Hey guys, T today I am going to be doing three different American Girl hairstyles. So, three different dolls that I'm going to do it with. Tenny, Z, and Julie. And there's a lot of stuff going on right now. I'm watching Apple Come on. Episode 16. Season 4. And, um, ciao. Fine. I <laughs> watched all the episodes up until that episode in the course of about five days. Craziness. And I also got food. So, yeah. Um. Okay. So, the first doll I'm going to be doing is Tiny. Alright, so I'm gonna start off with Tenny. Mm. So I'm gonna put the tablet. Okay, I'm gonna move over here. Over there. Move my whole entire station all the way over there. So here's Tony, and her hair looks a lot darker in it. Anyways, I'm going to spray her hair behind the camera because that just makes it easier and I don't want any getting on the camera. Right now I'm gonna brush. All right, so I'm gonna move Julie and Z. You guys should go, should go check out F Mouse channel and her series, which is called Phoenix Drop High School. And I'm on Drop and Play University, which is after high school. It's a pretty cool series, I like it. Alright, so now that I've brushed her hair, I need to get my tools. I need to take out a bunch of stuff because I don't need it. I don't need the scissors, obviously. It's for just in case like their hair's uneven or something. So now I'm going to do my signature Great thing. Okay, so I'm gonna pause my F my video so I can record. So um Oh, I'm um six minutes in of the video and four minutes in of this video. That means I watched two minutes of it before I started this video. Okay. Alright. Alright, so here she is. And I got her hair brushed. So 
so I'm trying to get the camera where you can see. Okay, so I'm gonna take a section of hair about this much. Actually, let's move some over there. Okay, and then this will be the chunk of hair that we use. So, you're gonna lift up your doll and use that chunk of hair. Oh. Okay, so, um, it's kind of hard to see, but, um, I'm gonna have to sit down for this. Um, okay, you guys, I'm having a lot of trouble right now. Okay, so, oh, um, well, all right, all right, okay. All right, so you need to take a part of that part of hair that you chose, which I have right here, and take a part of it, and then, guys, this is not working for me. Oh, my. Do I really need to use this tissue box to help hold it up so you guys can see? Yeah. Okay, so you need to take a strand of hair from your strand of hair right here and then obviously you want to keep your brush on you because <sighs> you never know whenever the doll's hair is going to get messy so that's why you needed to wet it a lot and the way I wet it was I put water in a spray bottle which is the best way to do it now if you don't really have a spray bottle or anything you could just wet your brush and that'll work I think I, I think I've tried it before and it's worked a bit do not brush your doll's hair like I do. I'm not the best at it. You're supposed to start from the bottom and then go at the top, but... Anyways, I came up with this hairstyle, and then I saw somebody do it on YouTube. So, I'm kind of confused about it, but you need to take it. Okay, that's way too much. Um... Okay, and then you need to take it, and you need to normally braid it. So just, don't braid, like, all the way down. Only braid about, maybe, three times. And you gotta do it all the way at the top. Oh, oh, oh dear. Um, yeah, that's why it's easier to do it whenever you aren't recording it. So that should be good. You need to take it, and then whenever you pull over the next one, you grab a strand of hair from over here, like about that much. Uh, why does the hair always look worse on camera? Anyways, so you need to take it, and then you need to put the hair with it, and then you need to continue braiding and do it for every single section. And if it goes on over, from this way, see, if it goes over this way, then you need to take the hair and you need to go under it and have it underneath. That's the way that I did it. And then you can need to continue that. And the original doll that I did this on was Leah, but I didn't choose to do her because her outfit kind of looked pretty bad. Um, because, yeah, it was for a series I wanted to start, but I obviously didn't start it. <sighs> yeah. I'm literally having to lean over so my back hurts. Great. Take the hair, go under, and should, and then whenever you run out of hair, you need to continue braiding. Wait, where'd my hair tie go? Oh, I found it. Here we go. Okay. So, whenever you get to the bottom of the braid right here, you need to take your hairband and... Put it on. 
and then you can brush the end and stuff make sure it looks all nice and neat and um, I think I'm gonna do the other part off camera so yeah so here's how mine turned out you if if you like have more time then yours probably will look better than mine but here's mine so I'm gonna do the other one off camera and you can stare at Z <laughs> um, yeah it's it's it takes longer whenever I'm recording and I think I'm gonna watch app now while I'm doing this so sorry if it takes longer than it probably needs to Probably because I don't want to stop my episode. <laughs> okay. I'm getting to the interesting part on here. So, yeah. And play. Yeah, and play. Play. Come on. Oh, jeez. Because this is in a knot. Uh, don't you hate it whenever your earphones are in a knot? Because I do. And they always get in a knot. Alright, I just undid it. Probably gonna listen to some music after this. Um, I am probably gonna be talking during this. And if I'm not talking, then that probably my earphones are here. This has bad sound, but good sound at the same time. This will probably take a while because I need to brush her hair. Okay, so I just finished the other one, which looks way better than the other one. Mm, way better. Okay. S 
so here's the one that I did off camera. Here's the one I did on camera because I could barely see it. So there's the first hairstyle, and I don't really have a name for it. Uh, the the special braids there. <laughs> I honestly have no clue. I never gave it a name. So next we're gonna be doing Z, and I have absolutely no clue what just happened to my video. Um, it just literally clicked off. So um, that's fun. Okay. <sighs> Let's take it out. Oh oh, get out of. <sighs> the brush got into Julie's hair. And I'm sorry that this is super long. Can't help it. So the next one. Oh. My. Goodness. It's just. Well, all my hair bands just fell out of the bag. Just got them. Back in the bag. So that's good. Okay. So, um. The next hairstyle I'm going to do is on Z. So, I need better support for this so you can't see. It blocks your view. A pillow. Let's use a pillow. <clears throat> I'm sorry, you guys. I'm having trouble with this. Okay, so I'm going to take off that thing on her mouth because it's distracting and to make it easier to do her hair style. So we got her. And first, you flip your doll over. Now, this is not like a hairstyle that I would just like say, do specifically for Z or something like that. I'm just doing it on Z because she's one of my dolls with long-ish hair. So you guys can't see it because how dark her hair is, but you need to take a strand at the top, you need to take it and you put it in a ponytail. It's just a teeny tiny bit. I'll, I'll show you from above whenever I get through with this part. And um, you guys can probably guess what hairstyle I'm doing. I don't know the name of it. Again. Okay, so here is the ponytail. This is going to be like an overall like hairstyle. Okay, so now that you got the ponytail, you need to take two, two strands of hair from each side. Okay, so and you see how we got the ponytail right here? Ponytail. You need to take a piece of hair from there, put it right here, and you take a piece of hair from here. Don't make it too big because, yeah, take a piece of hair from here. Up there. And then you need to, okay, and do this off camera because you guys can't see. But I'm going to take all the strands, all of them, and then I'm going to rubber band them together. Now, I bet you guys can guess where this is going now. If you don't, if you can't, I am very surprised. But, oh, and it's very important that you choose from the middle. Because if you don't do the middle, then it's probably going to end up hor looking horrible like mine will probably do. Because I just realized I did not do it down the middle. And then you need to repeat that pretty much using the middle one and grabbing two from each side. So I'm going to finish that off camera. So, yeah. I am going to go qu as quick as I can for this because you can guess why.
Uh, it's taking forever. Seriously, like... Oh, wow. I've been recording for a minute doing this. Oh, dear. Uh, why do I keep on doing the puns? Uh, and I'm doing the final strand. Zuh. More than a strand. And then I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. It does not look the best at all. So, um, it, oh gosh. Here's what it looks like. So you got all the different ones. Uh, yeah, it looked horrible. Now we're moving on to the next one. Okay. Now the next one. Next contestant is. <laughs> Why does it get the? <laughs> the headphones are really like Julie because they're all over. <laughs> okay, I got them untangled from Julie. I need to take off her. Take off the visor. And let's wet and brush her hair. Jeez. Oh. You guys can hear it. You can probably hear the. Alright, so I got the other part. Alright, so I just washed her. I'm totally! It's totally washed! Jeez. Okay, I finished brushing her hair. And then, now that I'm done, I'm very annoyed with my camera. It doesn't like me. You take Julie, and the first thing that you need to do is flip her over. <laughs> you doll. You're doing this song. Okay. So, what I'm going to be doing. I forgot what I was going to be doing. Okay. I got it. And um, I'm going to kind of do it off camera a little bit. I'm just going to explain what you do. Sorry to all the visual learners out there, but still. I can't help it. I'm new. I could probably make another video of this if I had a camera and a tripod. But I currently don't. So, I have a camera. And it's a tablet. And I had no clue for a video idea, so if you made it this far, give me a video idea in the comments down below, please. Um, yeah. What was the hairstyle of this that I was going to do on her? Uh, I already forgot the hairstyle. Jeez. I talk too much. Uh there were a pause button then I could pause this and I could think of what it was but there's no pause button and I am very very annoyed because of that uh, there was a hairstyle I was gonna do on her but got it anyways I I think what I'm going to do on her is, it, it's a pretty simple hairstyle, so a lot of people can do it. So basically you want to take a rubber band, and you make a, I remember what I wanted to do, okay, yeah, so you need to brush your doll's hair all the way up to the top of her head. Yeah, I know. <coughs> The reason I'm not showing it is because if I did, <clears throat> I would be having a lot more trouble than I am now. When I'm having a lot of trouble. <sighs> Take these off my fingers. Okay. Oh, oh, her hair looks a mess.
Alright, so I got I'm putting on the first hairband and you need to make like a high ponytail that's like literally directly above her head. I'm gonna show you what mine looks like whenever I can do it. It's hard because I don't have much space. That's my problem. <sighs> I like to spread out and usually I get very frustrated whenever I can't spread out whenever I don't have room to spread out everything gets chaotic in my opinion anyways and of course there is hair that decided to be mean and not go into ponytail oh dear uh, guys, this is very annoying. Jeez. I'm cutting off the hairband. It's very easy to. I usually do that whenever I mess up or like whenever I'm done with a hairstyle. Because that just makes it easy. You guys give me video suggestions in the comments down below. I want to know what you think I should make a video of. If I can figure out how to put it on a pole, then I probably could. But, yeah, and I don't even know what to do. I know one, which could be a room tour. Probably not going to do it, but... Or do y'all want to see another Q&A? If you want to see another Q&A, tell me in the comments down below. Okay, so... Alright, so here's how your ponytail should look. See, it's like a high ponytail. I guess you could say it looks like JoJo. JoJo Siwa. If you know who JoJo Siwa is, I'm surprised your ears aren't killed from her, honestly. Okay, so you need your high ponytail, and then you need to fan it out. So, fan it out. What I mean by that is just fan it out like this, where it goes like that. Kind of like a waterfall. That's why I call it fan it out. I have no clue why that's got to do with it. fanning it out, but still. So you need to take it, and then you need to pull it up, and then you need to, like, pull it up a bit. If you've got a doll that has long hair, if your doll has shorter hair, this is the best thing that would be, like, it would be better on a doll with short hair, like Luciana's hair or something. It's definitely not. Julie, I have no clue why I chose to do it on her, but I did, and it looks horrible. Oh my, it looks horrible. <laughs> I'm gonna take it out as soon as I'm done with this video, but bye. I'm sorry that this American Girl tutorial was so long. Bye.